Hi Libra, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot and I am here to do your reading for November 4th through the 11th. This is for Libra Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Keep in mind this reading might not be for you. It's not a private reading, okay? It's for a big audience, so it may be yours or it may not be. Good choice, huh? Okay, so we have a major new beginning here. You guys are about to start a new chapter. A new long-term chapter. It's like one lesson has been learned, one chapter has closed, right? And that's what this is what this is. One, one um, phase of your life is over. And you're about to embark on a new one. You may feel a little conflicted about this. You may feel like this is a little uncomfortable. But when you're starting something new, it can be a little uncomfortable. But things are happening fast. And you may not want this. You may not want this. But, you know, sometimes things are beyond your control. You may be trying to protect yourself. You may, be, you may have tried to block this. You may not want to believe it. You may not want to believe that something has ended. But the truth is, is that something has changed. It's happened fast. And you can't block it. You can't block this change. You can't. Oh, no, you can't. All right. So... Okay, so there's been a rude awakening that has come about. Something could have left your life like that. There could have been a some sort of major shift that caused an instant breakdown. You know what I mean? An instant, something has happened very quickly here. And it's not something that you could project, okay? This wasn't a solid, stable foundation in the first place. And so it was meant to crack. It was meant to crack, unfortunately. And now somebody has received some sort of rude awakening that has started them on a new chapter, okay? And you may feel like this is overwhelming. You may, you may feel like this is too fast. This is uncomfortable. You may feel like this is unreal even. Like, I don't even know what to do about this. And you may feel very, very defeated by this. You may feel like you're, you're, you've been brought right to your knees by whatever this is. It's like, I think there's some ties that have been severed, perhaps the hard way, and you don't want to believe it. It hurts. It really hurts. That sword of cuts and it hurts. You might feel like this is absolutely unreal. You probably do right now. You're like, no way. Well, you're not being logical here. <laughs> okay, and whatever is happening may make you feel angry, upset, um, resentful. You may feel um, like you've been deceived. And you probably have been deceived with that magician reversed. It's like no matter how much you want to pretend somebody was lying to you. Somebody wasn't, they were manipulating you. Whatever is happening is, is absolutely positively overwhelming. And it needs to, it needs this baggage that is left over needs to be dropped 
You don't need to involve yourself in this game anymore. You know, you may have been dealing with somebody who had hidden agendas. They were definitely taking advantage of you. And now it's time for you to see the light, even though you probably don't want to see the light. You may feel like you're a victim here. You've been left out in the cold and you're probably really, really upset. But this has happened for a reason. Because the tower comes in to remove things from your life that you have been in denial about. To get you to get to the victory and success that you are meant to have in this lifetime. The tower is a blessing in disguise sent to you from the universe. To make you find your power. To make you find those resources to shed the old things that you have not shed. The magician upright sheds his old skin and you have not done that. You have been holding on to something that is a lie. I'm sorry. A lot of you don't want to hear this shit. That's for damn truth. A lot of you do not want that veil, that mask, that fantasy, whatever, to be revealed. You don't want to hear it, and that's the truth. That's the meaning of this card. But it's time for you to shed that old skin, to have the victory and success that you deserve. And the universe says, okay, we're going to get, we're going to shake this up for you so that you find your power. You find your resources to bring success. If you don't take the, the magician reverse, you haven't been taking, you have to take the action. And if you aren't going to take the action, if you're going to live in denial, then we're going to do it for you. We're going to bring you some conflict. We're going to bring you some power struggles. We're going to make you upset. We're going to piss you off to make you have this new beginning. You're going to receive some undesirable news. That's a given. Be prepared to receive some message or some communication from somebody that you don't want to hear. There's an end of a commitment of some sort. This, it's, it's not going to make you happy. It's not going to make you happy. But it's going to lead you towards a new contract with something that is better suited for you. There's going to be an unexpected choice, an unexpected opportunity for love that comes out of this. Even though right now you're probably really pissed off. But in the end, you're going to find wish fulfillment. You're going to find the happiness that you deserve. Because it's time for you to cross that bridge. And make that difficult decision. Take that blindfold off and see the freaking light. You've been reluctant to cross the bridge. You've been reluctant to go through that door. You've been in complete denial over a situation, thinking that one thing was wish fulfillment, but it wasn't when you have somebody that's better suited for you. No shit. And now you're going to receive fast, quick communication that probably hurts. Something that pushes you in that new direction once and for all. Absolutely. Absolutely, change is on the horizon. You're about to be faced with 
a sudden move. A sudden change in direction. And you're going to, and this is a card of mental strength, right here. You're going to have to find your mental strength, that force within you, to put yourself back in the driver's seat. Even if it hurts. There's definitely some opposition here. There could even be some... There's definitely going to be some opposition. There's going to probably be some... There could even be some arguments, okay? Um, you're gonna, you may have to restrain yourself, okay? You may have to restrain yourself because there's a big upset here with that Ten of Wands. Something is going to be really heavy and overwhelming for you. But you're going to have to find your ability to restrain yourself from getting too upset. You could be dealing with an Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. You have somebody that may be upset with you. This person may be the one that gives you the message. Or it might be about this person. This person is greedy, self-centered. Ruthless, conceited. And it looks like this person lacks ambition and drive and confidence. And perhaps they don't mean to hurt you, but they're in their own misery. This person is in misery. There's a destined change of course coming. It's going to move you in a new direction, I think, away from this person. This person is very controlling. And I think whatever is happening is going to give you back control. If you can restrain yourself from losing it. This person's probably going to lose it. They probably they're not going to be able to control. It. There's there could be an argument, okay? But whatever is happening is going to bring you something much better. And I know a lot of you don't want to hear that. You don't want to believe that. Or you don't want to see it. It's That's no shit right here. But there's a change of course on the horizon. A big one. A big one. One phase of your life is completing. And that is no joke. And it's going to head you towards a lot of abundance, victory, and success. But it's going to hurt. I mean, it's major change coming here. Major. Seriously. So you guys are about to experience a major new beginning that you probably don't want. Yeah, The way that it happens, you, it's like, this is overwhelming for me. This is not what I want. Somebody's moving on. Somebody's moving. Moving on. From your life. By the looks of things. They're headed out. And that's what it looks like to me. Yeah. It's going to cause a loss. You're going to feel a loss. A loss of stability. A loss of balance. 
a loss of harmony. You may feel like you've been rejected and maybe you are going to get rejected. I don't know. But you're going to feel at a complete loss. But there is, a, there is another person, there's another person that can help you to get through this. This person is, maybe it's a friend, maybe it's a mother, maybe, it could be anybody, but it's a, it's a woman. It is, I feel like this is a woman. There's a woman that can help you heal from this situation. She is grounded. She is practical. She is very motherly. And it looks as though she sees what's going on. She probably sees that you're going to be at a complete loss. And she might help you to accept this truth, whatever it is. You are going to be receiving some sort of communication that cuts like a knife. But it's the truth. It's about this person, Aries Leo Sagittarius. And it's going to move you in and see, it's, the truth is coming about this person. Air, it could be a man, Aries Leo Sagittarius. could be a woman, I suppose, because I can't. I think this it's a man. Aries Leo Sagittarius, a man. You're going to receive some truth about this man that moves you in a new direction, causes some sort of upset. But in the end, it's going to... open up new doors for you. It is. It's going to bring you victory and success. It's going to bring you good fortune. You may even get some money out of this. This is something you should be prepared for. You may have already been preparing for this. This is getting prepared. Maybe you were prepared for this to happen. Or maybe you weren't. But it looks as though somebody's ship is arriving. Somebody is about to get on. Go on. A new journey. There's an opportunity here for healing. There's an opportunity for a new love, for a new beginning, for emotional support. There's absolutely a new beginning here that you have probably been blocking, even though subconsciously you've been getting prepared for it things are happening very quickly and I think this is a very big 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 week for you Libra I think that somebody is moving on and you probably it probably hurts But it's going to lead you towards more abundance and victory and success and love. It's destiny. It's a destined change of course that is going to bring you more emotional fulfillment than you've had It's going to bring you extreme happiness. Even though while you are feeling this pain,
You may feel uncomfortable and overwhelmed with that Ten of Wands. Understand that true suffering brings growth. So you have a new opportunity for, for, for love, Libra, that is going to make you extremely happy. You're about to begin a new phase of life, and that is no joke, okay? And it's major. We have a lot of majors here in the aces. I mean, we do. We are about to... You are about to experience a major transformation that is going to lead you down a new path towards extreme happiness. But it's going to be uncomfortable. But it's a blessing in disguise. So be prepared for some sort of major event, fated, major fated event to happen this week that changes your life forever. In a good way, even though it ain't going to feel good in the beginning. I'm sorry, it's not. Oh, we got a flyer. Stay optimistic about your love life. Positive thinking and faith will bring you romance. Somebody, I have to just, this magician reversed, which is under here somewhere. If it was even in your reading. I've done so many readings today. Somebody was trying to manifest something that they, that wasn't, that they, that wasn't meant to be. That's what this is. You can't manifest the wrong one. Even though some of you have tried to do that. So anyway, there's a change in direction. The winds of change. The winds of change are blowing. And you are being called to stay optimistic because this is going to change your life for the better. Allow your heart and soul to sing with joy. This is a new love that is coming into your life. After you face this change, this destined, fated change, of course. As far as I'm concerned, there's a major event that is going to shake up your life for the better. Be prepared. Get prepared. You know what this is, by the way. But you've been in denial about it. Be prepared for that rude awakening. Because the universe knows. And you can't fight the universe. These are universe, universe. Both The universe is at work here. You can't fight it. Good luck. 